Stroud and Simpson. You guys are loud today again. That means you're happy. Uh, yeah, it does. Uh... When you're happy, I'm happy. <laughs> yeah. Oh, hey, guys. What's up, man? So, I was just sitting here talking to my birds and stuff. Smoking myself a bowl of oat. No. What is this? This is backwoods. Smoking myself a bowl of backwoods. Actually, it's my own special blend. That's what I'm here to talk about today. You know, I don't mean to glorify smoking in any shape, way, or form. I don't. And I don't condone of children smoking. Or does it approve? I don't know. I don't approve of it. That's for sure. But anyways, I just wanted to throw this out there. If you're a cigarette smoker, and God, I know how it is, man. There's something about those cigarettes, though. I don't know if it's the heroin that they put in them or the fentanyl. <laughs> but there's something about them cigarettes that will grab you by the boo-boo. And uh, what I want to explain in this video is when I was still smoking cigarettes just a month and a half ago, two months ago or whatever. Um, actually, this has been for a long time. I noticed that I wanted to kill something every time I couldn't have a cigarette. But then every time I could have that cigarette, I'd get disappointed halfway through the cigarette because it tastes like shit and it fucking, you know, it takes your breathing capabilities away. It does. I don't care what anybody says. It does. It makes you cough all the time. And it's my belief that it's the shit they put in them cigarettes because I've been puffing on this pipe. You know, I didn't quit smoking. I quit smoking cigarettes and started smoking a pipe. And uh, I got to say, not only do I smell a lot better in the mornings and at night when I crawl into my bed, but uh, I feel better. I don't, I'm not short of breath. Well, maybe I am, but that's just me. <laughs> But uh, I'm not more short of breath than what I'm normally at. <laughs> and uh, and you know what else? This makes your teeth like half as yellow. I know this because my brown teeth are like turning yellow again, which is a good thing. With all them cigarettes, no matter how much you brush your teeth, them freaking cigarettes are going to turn them fuckers orange. <laughs> If you want orange teeth, kids, just smoke cigarettes. It'll it'll do it for you. <laughs> yeah, it will. Now, this probably will, too, but I honestly don't think so. I think it's just all the crap that they put in them cigarettes that does it. And I'm sure there's pipe tobaccos out there, too, that do it and shit like that and blah, blah, blah. But the whole thing is uh, if you're a heavy cigarette smoker you should seriously consider switching to a pipe because not only will it make people around you happier, it'll make yourself happier too. And at first you're gonna be like, what am I doing here? This ain't gonna satisfy me. But about a week into it, you're like, dang man, <laughs> what was I smoking them cigarettes for? Why? Well, what an idiot. <laughs> And you know, the other best part about the pipe is you can't just walk around with it hanging out of your mouth all the time while you're trying to work. And I know there's a lot of people out there that do that. I was guilty for that my whole life. I had a cigarette hanging out of my mouth, burning my eyes, fucking taking my breath away while I'm trying to do something. And you know, a guy just never learned his lesson. <laughs> and it's because of those goddamn cigarettes. And the addictive chemicals and the garbage and the amphetamines and the whatever's they put in them shit and things. Ain't no cigarette that went out is going to taste this good. Mom, did you just make a fresh batch of buns or something? Oh, 
Never mind, it's my pipe. <laughs> Seriously, you guys. Never again will I touch a fucking cigarette ever again. But yeah, going back to the beginning of the video, I don't glorify smoking for the non-smokers and shit. I really, I'm not trying to do that. What I'm trying to do is get you cigarette smokers out there to wake up to them damn cigarettes. I mean, you don't cram heroin in your fucking breakfast every morning, do you? No. Well, I hope not anyways. I don't. <laughs> and that's exactly what them cigarettes are pretty much just like. Is like methamphetamines or heroin or fentanyl laced cocaine. It's bad for you. My shit is bad for ya. I ain't down with them cigarettes no more. Mm -mm. Mm. But uh, anyways, I'm gonna go and enjoy my coffee and relight my bowl. You guys have a good journey, yo. Peace.